Hello and a very warm welcome to our brand new Movilla Abbey Church YouTube channel. Our church buildings may be temporarily closed, but we the church most definitely are not. We are very much open and it's wonderful that we can be together in this way. We're looking forward to worshipping together this Sunday and every Sunday at 11 a.m. Now, this is going to seem strange for a lot of us, engaging and relating in this way and even worshipping together. But for many churches all around the world, this form of communication is a normal and natural part of the way that relationships are maintained. It's a great way for us to be connected and be church together, whether we're sitting at home on our kitchen table, maybe sitting in the living room, maybe on a bus with our headphones in and watching on the phone or in a hospital bed. It's a great way for everybody to stay connected and for us to be church together. We want to get as many people as possible connected to Movilla Abbey Church in this way. So if you have a friend or relative who needs a computer or smart device or who needs help getting online, please get in touch and we'll do our best to get them connected. The web address is tinyurl.com forward slash Movilla Abbey Church. That's tinyurl.com forward slash Movilla Abbey Church. So how will this all work? Well, assuming that you have entered the correct website address and you're ready to go, we're going to invite you each Sunday morning at about 10 to 11 to get ready to have everything set up, ready to begin. And then at 11 a.m., when the service will be ready to view, you can click play and we can all join in worship together at the same time. Now, the service will be available uh, from 11 o'clock onwards. So if you're unable to make 11 o'clock, you could see it later. But it would be lovely if we could all be together at that time. You'll see that when we gather, we will be doing what is very familiar from a Sunday morning. There will be prayer. There will be the singing of worship. There will be the reading of scripture and a sermon and encouragement for us to live our lives for Christ. For our very first act of worship this coming Sunday on the 22nd of March, we would like to be able to break bread together. Now this is going to look very different, obviously, with us all being in our homes in different places. But we would love to be able to share this very special meal that unites us as the body of Christ. So Michael and I will say the words of consecration at the appropriate point, but you will need to prepare the bread and wine. So we're going to invite you to get a slice of bread or maybe a bread roll or a cracker, a small glass of wine or grape juice or squash or whatever is appropriate for you so that we can share in this meal together. We'll see you on Sunday. Grace and peace be with you.